Alright. Well, haven't done a video in a for the Dell Intron 531 with it running Windows 7. Uh, that loud noise in the background is the TV. So, I got it right here. Right there, Dell logo, Windows Vista, AMD, Athlon, Dell Core X2, also a 64 bit processor. This is the Inspiron 31, which I had did a video a while back, way before running Vista Home Premium. Yep, you got the floppy drive right here, some headphone jack, microphone, four USB ports. Probably can't see it that well. Probably see the black expansion drive. Ain't no extra drive. I can get to open this. I can open it. Yeah, there's no drive right here. This is the CD and DVD drive. It's re also a DVD rewritable. On the rewritable drive. Yep, this is a wireless router, which I need to get drivers for. And I don't know the password on If y'all know how to reset a password to the router, please tell me how, which software I need for the Linksys router. This is the modem for the internet and the good printer. So let's go ahead and fire this thing on. Should come up. There we go. I had to make sure the wire was tightened on this monitor. This is my second take. I had to turn it off by force. Yep, Windows 7 Home Premium. Just to let you know, if you want to know which, which Windows 7 Home Premium this is, this is Windows 7 Home Premium 64 bit running at on a Dell Inspiron 531. The minimum requirements for 64 bit, you got to have 2 gigabytes of RAM. You may not hear no sound, is because I have headphones hooked up. I got them rigged. Because sometimes it'll play from this speaker and you have the headphones. But so there we go. Make sure this is in. I'm trying to make sure the cable on the monitor was not tightened on here. Because. Whenever I had it, it was kind of loose. Because I had the the old Dell Dimension XPS T500 in here on the internet, grabbing a few updates for Windows 2000. So here we go. And the system rating is 3.2. Two gigabytes of RAM, AMD Athlon, 64x2 dual core processor. Yep, and it's activated. Yep, you see the Windows 7 logo. Also got Firefox. This is Windows 7 Home Premium 64 bit. Let me see if it says. Yep, it is right there. See 64 bit. Just wanted to make sure. Sure to show y'all proof. So here is Microsoft Office 2003. It works pretty good. Feel it. This is. Try to type with it. It's kind of hard to type with the key camera in your hand. 
See? This is off of 2003 service tax. Three. Yes, I got virtual PC on this. Got all my operating systems. Let's play with ME. Yep. No, I took them. I, I have them saved on the external hard drive. All my virtual machines. I'm gonna hit allow access. Hold on, I gotta fix it. Can't hardly see the cursor, that's why it... I'm trying to fix the window a bit. Just bear with me. It does have Internet Explorer 64 bit on this thing. Tell the cursor's all screwed up. Let me fix it a bit. Put out a lower one so you could be able to. It's kind of hard to. There's a problem there, so. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and cut it off. We ain't got time to mess with them for now. And also got C Cleaner. I'm going to tell you more from some of the, about the computer right here. Yes. I got Skype, Windows Live Messenger. I kind of got like how it is how it is on XP and Vista, like your internet browser, email client. It. Yeah, this is my mom's computer. And it works fine with Windows Arrow. So I'm gonna go back, go ahead and upload this video. I just wanted to show you how, how Windows 7 runs on this Dell Inspiron 531. So I'll see you guys later before I go over the time limit on YouTube. All right, see ya. Comment, rate, subscribe, or whatever.